Six years ago, she was the unintended victim in a drive-by shooting, but Guadalupe Galeno Hernandez never let her paralyzing injury stop her. Today, family and friends celebrated her progress. The 18-year-old will never walk again, but continues to make improvements in her range of motion. She also recently graduated from South High School. Rachel Slavic was there for a celebration as Guadalupe prepares for life's next challenge. Hi. I got Guadalupe. Hey. Hi. This may not seem like a significant moment, but there was a time when Guadalupe Galeno Hernandez couldn't enter a room on her own. I'm better. I'm movement. I can do a lot more stuff than I used to do. Every move is a mark of her physical progress, overshadowing the moment that changed her life. Well, I got shot when I was 12, and like I got paralyzed, and I was really bad at the hospital. In November of 2010, the then 12-year-old Guadalupe was hit by the stray bullet of a drive-by shooting. That bullet entered her neck, piercing her spine, and left more than a lasting injury. I didn't even do anything, and it just, I don't know. And now, like, I can't walk because of him. I cannot do stuff I used to do because of him. So, like, I will always be angry. Her best revenge may be her fighting spirit. In overcoming her physical challenges, she's inspired people like V.J. Smith, who works to ensure others don't become the unintended target of violence. For every gang member, every thug, every clique, every, every banger should be thinking about Guadalupe when they think about what they're doing in the street. Guadalupe's focus is now on the milestones of teenage life, a first boyfriend, high school graduation, and now college. Mm, now where can I be in a teacher? She knows the next chapter has its own challenges, but Guadalupe also knows how to overcome incredible odds. For me to my mom and my brothers and my family and stuff, it just gets me going. Rachel Slavic, WCCO 4 News. Guadalupe continues to attend physical therapy for her recovery. The man who shot her, Marlon Lozano Montana, was sentenced to 13 years in prison.